the media training by the National Tuberculosis and Leprosy Control Program and Breakthrough Action Nigeria is to enable the media understand the prevention and control of tuberculosis in Nigeria, highlight the similarities and differences between tuberculosis and COVID-19 and the stigma around cough as well as empower participants to accurately report on TB. The Head of Advocacy and Social Mobilization National TB and Leprosy Control Program, Mrs. Etohuo Oko, said although TB is a leading cause of death from a single infectious agent, COVID-19 has impacted on its implementation. TB, which is spread through the air when an infected person coughs or sneezes, kills 18 Nigerians every hour, and in 2018, one 157,000 patients died due to the disease. According to the World Health Organization, two out of every 1,000 Nigerians will have tuberculosis and that one case of untreated pulmonary TB can infect 10 to 15 persons by year. Mrs. Oko said the global tuberculosis report of 2019 indicates that in 2018, a total of 106,533 TB patients were notified, meaning many more are in the communities not notified. Speaking on the impact of COVID-19 on TB treatment and testing, Mrs. Oko said there has been a decline in tuberculosis testing and treatment since the advent of COVID-19. This is because TB and COVID-19 have some similarities in symptoms like cough, fever, and difficulty in breathing. Though COVID-19 comes with dry cough and high-grade fever, while TB has cough with spectrum, many Nigerians are still afraid to visit health facilities for fear of stigma around cough. The Head of Advocacy and Social Mobilization noted that the nationwide lockdown as a result of COVID-19 had prevented many TB patients from accessing treatment due to the stay-at-home policy. Also, the fear of COVID-19 resulted in stigma around cough, and even those who visit hospital refused to report cough as a symptom. Symptoms of tuberculosis, she added, are cough for more than two weeks, loss of weight, dredging night, sweating, and low fever. Testing for TB is free in all government direct outpatient treatment sites. Dot. So also is the treatment. Senior Program Officer Media Ban Eze Eze site. The media has been saturated of late with COVID-19 messages and there is need to increase reportage on tuberculosis and other public health diseases. Elizabeth Ka, BATV News.